Stop buying whipped cream at the store. Instead, just buy some heavy whipping cream and make your own. That way you can control the sugar that you put into it and it's really, really easy and quick. And you can say you made your own as well. So all you need to do is add a couple cups of heavy whipping cream, add a little bit of sugar, adjust it according to taste and what you like. So if you like it really sweet, add a little bit more. If you like it less sweet, add less. Add a little bit of vanilla. I like using pure vanilla extract because that imitation stuff just isn't good. And all I'm gonna do is beat the crap out of it. As you can see, some bubbles are forming and all we're doing when we whip the cream is incorporating air into it. And we wanna whip it until it's nice and fluffy and stiff peaks form. Now using the whipped cream that I just made, I'm gonna show you guys how to make an awesome no-churn chocolate ice cream. Yeah, you heard me, no-churn. So I'm gonna take just a bowl, one 14-ounce can of condensed milk. Condensed milk is essentially milk and sugar that's been reduced to a nice viscosity just like this. So it's actually really good on its own, even if you just eat it with your fingers. Then I'm gonna add one cup of chocolate syrup. Just combine those two really quickly. Then I'm gonna add a quick pinch of salt. I like my chocolate ice cream a little bit salty. Again, you get that sweet and salty flavor combination. Last but not least, that homemade whipped cream that you just made. So the key to this is actually making sure you fold the condensed milk and chocolate syrup mixture into the whipped cream. You don't want to deflate that whipped cream, but you still want to keep the consistency nice and fluffy. The most important thing is you don't want to over mix it. Then you simply pour it into a loaf pan, and then you just want to cover it with some plastic wrap. So after you cover this with plastic wrap, freeze it for about four to six hours, but preferably overnight. But, you know, luck has it that I may have made a second batch already. Let me show you how delicious and decadent this ice cream is. Mmm. Delicious, easy, and it only took four ingredients. Doesn't get any better than that. Thanks for watching, everyone. To subscribe, click up top. And for more food to get you laid videos, click over here.